Okay. So, <clears throat> what I'm planning to do for this video is to, um, well, I'm going to change the tree farm so it can work with birch and jungle trees as well. And then I also am going to, tr pl I'm planning on building a mob farm just right up this hole. Right, straight up here, up above. And then I'll have like a water stream that carries it down to a chest or something. But I will change this also so I will get some saplings from it. And yeah, I have it all planned out in Creative World. So we'll see how this goes. And I'll probably get some more wood generally for stuff. So yeah. Let's we'll see how this goes. Well, I guess I'll get to work then this here and I've actually got pretty much everything not everything I'm never mind I'm not even close really actually no I'm pretty close so I have the uh, level piston extender it doesn't have to fire when it pulls back cause it's only pushing um, the, the tree so that's pretty much already I do need to hook up these pistons over here because otherwise the tree will not grow. So there has to be a piston there. So we'll have to wire that all up. And just work everything so it works right. Come on. Don't need the redstone right now. And I'll have to hook up everything, but all going pretty smooth and I need one more up here I've never really built this this is the most complicated thing I've ever built with re involving redstone and survival so yeah we'll see how that goes so let's I just need to bring this around back here so the piston should be right here Yes. So I should just be able to put redstone there. Right. Okay, let's just hop up the stairway. And pop that in there. Let's just collect this stuff first. Go back around, come up, place this here, ah, redstone, redstone, and, okay, let's break this block, that, that, and that, and then I will put this here, then that should be all of them. When I flip this lever, I should get the double piston extension. Um, that all sounded right. And then these blocks are now out of the way. So I can put you here. No, not you there. Nope. And then get up here. Come on. Work with me. And then if I build up here. Then hop on down, flip the lever, and it all should be moved. Perfect. Anyway, I guess I'll record when I'm done with this. I'm gonna finish with this part of it. So yeah, well, yeah, yeah. This is working pretty well. Okay, so I did figure out how to make it work. Well, I didn't ever have really a problem, but I did finish it. And it works with birch, and if it works with birch, it works with jungle. So that means it'll work with more than just um, more than just oak. So I can get a steady supply of birch and jungle easily, like I have with the oak. And then you are not a problem. I can get dark oak and acacia. I don't know. I don't know about it. Uh, no one's asked for it. People have asked for birch though. So this works. Yep. 
birch tree, all, all good. Got my wood. Now if I use this hoe, which has fortune on it, I can get stuff. See? Sapling. So yeah, I'll work on the decoration. And then I guess I'll start on the mob farm. Uh, I might have to get a light for that, honestly. It's going to be up in the sky. So yeah, anyway, I'll get working on that. Okay, so it took me a while, but I think I got the super smelter all up and running. So it'll take stuff from the s furnaces here, and this dispenses the coal. Not dispenses, but spreads out the coal. Oh, I need to put the minecart back on. And then, if I get you on. And then. That should be no. Needs to be moving. You need to go here. And I'm gonna head and grab some coal and then I'll smelt a stack of stone just to see if it works. So I'm gonna head over here. Get a stack of coal. Coal, where are you? Mm, that should give me enough coal. Oh shoot, that was boring. One stack of coal. No! And then I will be able to test the super smelter. And then I'll once shove the stuff in. You go here. You go here. And I'll 